Hello, today I'm going to show you how to clean your PC from the inside. You have to do this at least, you know, every few months. Uh, get rid of all the dust that's in there. When you first get started, you first make sure you log off, sign off, and you power off. When you power off, make sure you unplug it, okay? A few seconds and you could open it up here. I'll show you. A lot of, uh, most PCs are built the same way. They're either like a, a couple screws they need to take out or a latch that takes out the panels. This one just has four screws, right? And pull up. Take a brush. When you see dust, you could do this, you know, every every week. You could just do it like that to get some, some of the dust out. Because you need to clear the um, the path. It has, it has to breathe. The fan has to get in. You don't want to like take a vacuum and blow an air in there or an air can because you're just blowing in dust into the circuit board. You don't want to do that. So all you do is just brush off on the outside and then later on we're going to use the um, vacuum cleaner to blow out the air, all the dust out there. And just in between here too, all the connections when you pull them out. It's also a good idea to clean the um, USB connection because they could get um, dirty and it could be filled with dust. So I just pour that in a little tray so you could control the amount, just cleaning alcohol. I like to use Q-tips, this way you can control the flow, that way you don't get too much on there. And you go, this is where all the connections are. Sometimes they get dirty and it contacts, doesn't want to, this, this could be a fix too, if you have problems with the mouse, keyboard connection, make sure that's all cleaned up inside there. Please, we can open it up. I should just slide right out. There you go. You want to look at it uh, this way. What we're going to need to do is, here's the fan, and this is the power supply fan. There's also a fan here, so you want to clean this area. And I'm going to use a vacuum cleaner. I'm going to use it um, the opposite way, so it blows the air. You don't want to, you know, suck it in. You just want to blow it all out. All right. All right. Here we go. You can see, you can see some of the. Um, Stuff coming out of it. There you go. You want to get that all out. Also, if you don't have a vacuum cleaner, you could always use a hair dryer, but don't put it on hot. You'd always want to put it on cold, so it's on cold. There you go. You could blow it up like that. Also, when you have the panels out, you need to make sure this is all clear. This is not here for uh, <clears throat> decoration. They have holes for a purpose. It just lets air uh, flow through the uh, PC. So we want to clean that up too. Even these little things. This is for the Apple people. The only place you know, it looks, you don't see any vents here. You could clean out um, the USB connections over here. But a lot of times you gotta look underneath and there's your, uh, the vents. See that, you just gotta wipe that up. And then if you wipe it up, then then you use the vacuum cleaner to um, get all the dust out. That's, you know, there's not too much to it, but that's where, that's where everything's hidden. That's where all the vents are. And also don't forget, you know, to clean the uh, USB connections, all right? Thanks for watching.